next up is... And inducing his opponent, coming out of the blue corner, Shadid Vatsayev! This bout is fought in the Ballerino Super Lightweight Division and they are fighting for the European title. Introducing first your fighter in the red corner, representing Team Renegade, Mateus Muzrowski! And introducing his opponent in the blue corner, representing Apex, Shadid Vatsayev! We go to your referee, Mr. Stuart Davies. Shadid Zatiev, Matias Mazarowski. All the playful, ooh, and Shadid comes out with a heavy leg kick too, and he chops him down. He didn't come to play. The Apex MMA fella, and now makes him step heavy, and he's in on the double leg. Almost tears himself through the cage there, and he's switched to a single. Can he hike it up into a snatch position? Yeah, that's a very strong position. He's got him on that single leg. He wants to try and draw him away from the cage. Oh, switch to a double, gets hands together. But wisely, he's got his legs nice and wide. It makes it difficult. How could he finish the single, Steve? Oh, he's up on the body lock now, Chris. He did. There you go. He's going to be in there. He's got to pull those hips in and try to kick out that, that near leg of Matias. Oh, beautiful Came knee. out really well with leg kicks. I was surprised to see him shoot rather than just continue chopping the legs of Matias Mazarowski. But Shadid, there you go. He drops in, collects the legs, and gets the takedown. Yeah, just really well. There's the fallacy of going for the of don't being silly and jumping on the gilly. <laughs> Matias Mazarowski. And now we've got some shoulder pressure working. We're talking about Shadid. percentages earlier, Steve. Like how often does you know driving on the guillotine when someone shoots actually work? And how often do you end up just on the bottom? Here we go. Hands to the floor. This could possibly lead to a sweep. He's got a butterfly and an overwrap. If he can kick through. He's trying to make space. Using that forearm. Not entirely sure what he's doing with the overwrap. There we go. Now he's moved himself into a mount position. This was just a masterclass so far from Matias Mazarowski. He's been able to just move himself. I'm sorry. It's been a masterclass by Shad <laughs> Shadid Vatsiev. Mazarowski's left just clinging on as the minute ticks down. Shadid doing well to bring his forearm in front of the neck. And this is a very strong position, but the t seconds are ticking down. Mazarowski probably wants to get back to his feet, and he knows that they have to restart there at the end of the first round. Can Shadid land some big shots and put a bit of fear into the heart of Mazarowski? 30 seconds. No, it doesn't do much, but if he keeps his he keeps this connection, Chris, he's going to be able to really stifle the shots. Oh, he's looking for an S-mount there to spin, but ends up on the back with a hook. Looking for a second hook, he's going to pull him back into him just like that. Throw that second hook in. He's nice. got 15 seconds to try and get under the chin. That's nice. He's going to crank the face for 15 seconds. 
Often when you've got a short time left around, you're better off just doing that, hitting them. Oh. Boom, look at these big shots are, are still landing. There's still a few there that did a lot of damage. That's a big round. That's a huge, even just to put the fear of God in you. Yeah. Big leg kicks, and they had Mazarowski just falling all over the place like a baby deer. And yeah. then the shots, the takedown, great pressure in the guard as well to be able to then pass, just step over and pass and slide up in the mount. Yeah, and it's uh, it's the hottest day of the year here in England. And uh, you can see him being fanned by the teammate over there. And it is, uh, it is absolutely stifling heat. And then we've got a packed venue. Oh, no, the, one of the heavyweight fights has fallen. That's no good. We like the heavyweights. They are, do seem to have the most health problems, though. <laughs> yeah, great back take here. Shadid Vatsi have shown that he really showed up. And he wants to win, even against the big, bad Team Renegade standout, Matthias Mazarowski. And Team Renegade have had a very good evening. Had a great, a great run. But all good runs have to come to an end. And I was saying, Chris, that the winner of this is probably on a collision course with our man, Cleed Edisha. So. Oh, yeah. Taking on the eagle. So you might, we might be seeing the styles. Oh, Stuart Davies isn't going to have it. He's going to tell you to back up. He's going to tell you back up. Shadiv Atsayev, he's keen to go. I like the swagger of Matthias Mazarowski, though. I like it. Pushing yeah. his gloves together. He's like, no, we're back, bro. We're back. We're back standing up. Matthias has so much power as well. He I might have lost away. round one, but that was then. This is now. A oh, beautiful left hook. Snapping jab comes out from the southpaw stance for Shadid, and then he dives in on the single, and he comes right up, and look at this, into it. That, oh, the, this is a bit under the chin. Now he turns his head in. This is yeah, it, it's arm in. I think he'd be, he'd be fine here. He's in the butterfly hook. He can use this to sweep, though. Yep. And Matthias, Matthias Mazarowski really needs... Oh, he lets it go, but he does have the butterfly. And now we're back in the old ways. A jab that snapped back the head of Mazias Mazarowski. Shadid now locking the body. It's a great way of passing this this position. He's trying to make space. Is Mateus trying to get back to his feet, back to the strike. He's dallied on the guillotine again. It's the, the Steve Brinkman, don't be silly and go for the gilly. Don't be silly, jump the gilly, boy. <laughs> he was almost out there and then decided to sit back because he saw that neck and this is better for by Mateus trying to get back to his feet. This has worked out well for Mateus, but his arm is way behind his head here. Yeah. Shadid might be able to just and drag him back to the mat. And this is the thing, now Shadid look, kicks the back of the leg there. Very nice, kicking out that, that position. And now he's way on the back. Can he get up? Why is he holding on? Oh, it was, a, it was a bit of a sloppy takedown, I thought, Steve. And he's ended up on the bottom. This is where Mateus Mazarowski wants to be. He's got oh, power, yes. but he doesn't want to get triangled. There's your deadlift position there. <laughs> yeah. That, was that that submission was fast, but like I was saying earlier, it's the hottest day of the year here in the UK. Whoa, oh, look at that! Slipping to the legs! That's beautiful jiu-jitsu. Terrible MMA idea, but <laughs> I appreciate the technique. And now this this definitely favors Mazarowski. Oh, what a comeback this Stuart is. giving a close look here. I mean, Shadid clearly took round one, but Mazarowski has rallied for round two. Has he ever? Yeah, Shadid needs to get onto his right hand side, try and get his right shin across the body to make space, but he gives up the mount. Now Mateus can rain down punches. victory from the jaws of defeat. It might be Mat Matthias Mazarowski's night. Yeah. 40 seconds left. Who wants this European belt? This is excellent. Eyes wide open for Vasiev. 25 uh, seconds remaining, and he goes arm. for the armbar. Love that. 20 seconds to go. Looking he's straight for a finish. He's, he's on the hand. Hammer he's fist to the face. It's a very good way of releasing the grip, I find, Steve. Just smash their face with a hammer fist. Short 10 seconds to try and break the grip and just yank on that arm. Wow, wow. Just a just a full tilt round. This might end up belly Three down with seconds. the arm. Three seconds. It's got the arm. So close, but there's the... Wow. It's a round apiece, folks. There's no debating, it's a round apiece, a round. and we're going into the third, and it's for a title. This, what a fight, what an absolute fight. I looked at this on paper, and I thought, this could be fight of the night, and it is so far, two rounds in, delivered, delivered and then some. But just a mistake, just a mistake on Shadid's, uh, Shadid's point. You get on top and you stay on top. It is, he kept the body lock when he could have been posting up and looking to stand back up and making it even again. Yeah. And now he's eaten a ton of punishment and almost had his arm broke. And a very weird oh, but take look down. at how tired Matthias Mazarowski yeah, is. Yeah, he 
burn himself out there. And then Shadid does look a little bit fresher. I mean, they're both retired, let's be honest. <laughs> this is when you start slapping your fighter in the body. Pinching, pinching right under his under his triceps. Yes. Really, That's really pisses like. people off. I just do annoy you. Okay. Yeah. Well, it does, it just wakes you up a bit. I got you. You ever, you ever want to wake yourself up? Pinch yourself right under the tricep. Ooh. Oh, it's already done that. He's pinched himself. I doubt. Steve, you're a crazy person. Jeez, it hurts. Okay. Oh, look, Mateus is oh, going That's it's a clever, that's trick. clever. I see you, you what clever you boys. Nobody's, they didn't spill the ice, though. No, if your fighter's a little bit tired, you accidentally, in quotes, oh, spill a little bit of water. Up, he's, he's up. The crowd, the renegade faithful are here, Mateus. and they want to see a third round, as do I. Oh, don't know, I just, here we go. See it, let's see some heavy leg kicks coming out, I bet. It's a good oh, round of peace. But does he have the, does he have it in the tank? That's it. Mateus pouring it on him now. It's time to flip the script, big guy. He's just got a better gas tank, it looks like, going into round three. He's straight to the back this time. Oh. Hammer shots. <laughs> Look at that. Now he's sneaking in. And he's all on top of him. Got the hooks in. I don't think he'll be going for an arm bar this time, but you never know. He got some great hammer fist action there earlier. That's it. Just doesn't know where he is at the moment but he knows it's bad. Oh, that's definitely bad. Especially with two minutes 15 left to go. He's clearing that hook though with his hand. That was clever. See a lot of that now, people clearing the hooks with the hand. It used to be, oh, you have to defend the neck, but if you've got one good defensive grip, you can use your other hand to try and strip. I like that uh, Matty has tried to punch the choke there. Yeah. Oh, little back heels to the body from the back. Just the consummate mixed martial artist. Once again, Mateus trying to sneak under the chin, look for a way to finish. He tries to slide his hips out. One minute 44. He's on the back, and there he sneaks it again, but he, can he get his other hand out to try to tie up that choke, and he can't do it at that moment. The team renegade corner is just demonstrating chokes from the other side of the cage. I think he knows how to do it. It's just Shadid is making it very difficult. Defending is rude. It was a great three minutes for Vatsyev, and it's been an excellent, excellent five for Matthias Mazarovsky. Man, he's doing brilliantly. The thing is about this, he's having a very dominant round. It might switch to body triangle now, but he is not. Oh, don't do that, Shadi. Come on, let's try and get up. Don't try the stupid footlock that never works. But he's not done any damage this round. He's definitely been winning this round. But it could all change with 50 seconds to go, but he hasn't, he's just been looking for the choke. But now he's raining down punches. Now he's in a great position. Can we get a finish to cement the European super lightweight champion? 30 seconds left in round number three. Kicking off the hooks. It's exhausting. 30 seconds. And he's back on the neck, and now he can connect the hands. Now he's got them together. He just doesn't quite have the uh, the pressure here. He's squeezing. He's just been on the back the whole time. Now he's raining down right hands, right hands, right hands. Three seconds, and now a big flurry to end it. Matthias Mazurowski, he wanted it the most, and he proves it here in the third round. He's saying, Cleddy Disha, take notice. The European champion has arrived. We've got to go to the judges' scorecards. But we all know how Matthias Mazurowski thought it went. We know how Team Renegade thought it went. And we know how the fans here in Coventry thought it went. Now it just is up to the uh, judges to agree. Go to the cage for the official decision. But as we run back, a few choice moments from that fight. It was such a dominant first round. It was almost, it was his to lose, was it? Shadid Vatsyev owning every second of the first round, kicking the legs out of Matthias Mazurowski. He must have been intimidated by that. And then, it's just continuing the then. onslaught. Matthias snatched victories from the jaws of defeat, or maybe Shadid Vatsyev sh snatched defeat from After the jaws of defeat. After three rounds of action, we go to the judges' scorecards. Your ballerina, 
European super lightweight champion in the red corner, Janine Latsayev! He says, give me my strap.